Let us understand how to use Panda library as a part of Python. Zeppelin supports Python by default and we can include Pandas as well. The reason why Pandas is going to play a significant role in analysis, it's very powerful when it comes to analyzing the structured data as well as it's open source. It's very powerful on reshaping, pivoting, slicing, dicing, indexing, subsetting, grouping, aggregation, transformation, joins, and many more operations against the structured data. And Pandas can be downloaded from this particular URL. The server where we are running the Zeppelin server, there it has to have the Pandas installation and the location where the Pandas is installed that should be added as a path of that specific system. And uh, Python provides a library or utility called Conda that's going to facilitate to install the packages. It would take care of downloading all the dependent packages and install. And that's going to be very heavyweight and it provides another option called Miniconda that's going to be very lightweight and that would facilitate to install the packages. So once the Miniconda is installed from the specific URL, I can install the pandas library using the command conda install pandas. Along with pandas, there is another package called pandasql that will be very frequently or predominantly used on analyzing the structured data where I can give the instructions in the SQL form. Let us see a small example of how to use it. I'm going to create a new notebook. I'm going to import the panda libraries. Already the pandas installed using the conda within the server location where it is available. It's a wizard way of installation. Provide the response to the questions in the wizard and uh, the installation should happen within few minutes. And I have a small CSV file as a part of my server where I have the Zeppelin installed. So this is a small CSV file where the delimiter is semicolon. I'm going to use this particular file. Basically, I'm going to read within pandas. There is an option called read CSV. Not necessarily it should take only comma as the separator. I can explicitly mention what is going to be the separator. Then using the Python SQL, from this particular data rates data, I can do any query that I want. I'm going to select all the records where the age is less than 40. So it's going to read the file and get the result and any slicing, dicing or any sort of analysis I wanted to do, I can do against this. So this is a simple demo and Pandas is very powerful in terms of reading the structured data. Whatever the processing that we want, that we can do. And Pandas and Python is not scope of the Zeppelin. This is just an interpreter that's going to facilitate to interact with the Pandas library once we install it.